The FTEC aircraft compass instrument displays magnetic and true heading as well as ground track. On the face of it, it is a very simple instrument, but it has some very clever tricks up its sleeve. By default, it shows magnetic heading and the heading source is set to automatic. This means that if you are moving at a speed less than the GPS transition speed, it will use the internal magnetic sensors of your device. But once you pass the GPS transition speed, it will start to use the GPS ground track as the heading source. You are able to change the GPS transition speed in the app wide settings. On the screen here, we see a full screen representation of the aircraft compass. It shows our heading, it shows our heading reference. This can be either magnetic or true. It shows our heading source, which can be either automatic, GPS or magnetometer. And lastly, it shows our current magnetic declination at our current location. This is calculated dynamically using the World Geomagnetic Model. The aircraft compass also has a user settable heading bug. You can set this by dragging either end of the bug, the heading end or the reciprocal heading end. Under the settings for the aircraft compass, you can change the heading source, you can change the heading reference, and you can toggle off the individual display parameters depending on what you'd like to see on your instrument. You can see here we've changed the heading source to GPS and the heading reference to true. This is reflected in the instrument here by the true in blue and the GPS heading source down here showing GPS. That's the aircraft compass. Hope you enjoyed it.